before we even decide to tell you anything about this movie, I want you to click subscribe. We'll wait. How, how do we know if they clicked subscribe? We'll never know. Oh, you're already recording? Mm -hmm. Well, I already fucked this up. Reviews! <laughs> Hey, hi, hello, welcome to another furious edition of s something smart, something dumb, and everything else. Today, we are here talking about the fate of the furious. We should have gotten a car. Well, From, this one basically is a car. Yeah. A flying car. Oh. I got the Spider-Man, he's got the Iron Man, she's Whoa! got the Winnie the Pooh. Uh, what do we got for our wow. non-sponsored drink of the day? Non-sponsored drink of the day is brought to you by Ain W Root Beer since 1956. Years, yo. I've got my Earl Grey tea. And I've got my tap water. Is that Norwegian? So. It's just classic. Literally came from the tap. We have filtered water too. <laughs> because he's so extreme. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this isn't triple X. Oh, should you see it, skip it, or stream it? Mm -hmm. I say it, it depends. I mean, obviously, if you're a fan of the franchise, you gotta see it. You gotta it's, see it. If you're coming in not seeing any of them, you're good to skip it. That's then, a I'd hard say. pass. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then if you well. don't mind just guilty pleasure action movies or action movies where you don't need mm -hmm. to think too hard, <laughs> then maybe stream it. When we were seeing reviews, some people are mm -hmm. saying it's the best movie ever. Some yeah. people are saying it's the worst movie ever. So if you're looking what to us to tell you what yeah, you fun. should do with this movie, make up your own mind. We're not going to help you. <laughs> Let's start things off with uh, something dumb. Well, without getting into too many spoilers, mm -hmm. safe space. Right, so uh, there's a... A thing that I'm kind of done with mm -hmm. uh, that's in movies these days, it's this like hacker on hacker battle. It's the like, I'm breaking into the mainframe. I'm going to get you. Oh, you think you could do that? Yeah. Well, I, will, I can get you. No, you can't get me. I'm hacking. It's, seeing those types of scenes just makes me feel like I'm watching two random people play Battleship. But the difference weird. is, is at least with Battleship, there's a visual element that <laughs> says who's winning. But it's it's brutal because every movie has a different interpretation of what hacking is. Mm -hmm. And it's just a lot of smack in your fingers. <laughs> like the faster well, you, you know, smack, the more you win. You gotta be able to type 120 words a minute. That's I thought that was fast. just in general. No. Oh. To be There's hacker. no way you type that fast. No, I know I don't. You're like that. I know. No, no, you forget. I'm a three finger <laughs> guy. There's a lot of cheese. It seems like with each sequel, they amp up the cheesiness. Mm -hmm. And that's something that, for me, watching it is definitely something dumb. But doing a lead into something <laughs> smart, what makes this franchise almost watchable is almost how bad it can be, but still be enjoyable. And that's where the cheesy factor comes into it, where when Triple X came out, they were being cheesy on purpose and being yeah. like, hey, like, really hey, isn't it. this cheesy? And then you're like, no, don't wink at me. Like, just be cheesy. It's all about taking it deadly serious. Mm -hmm. And it's cheesy and it's funny yeah. because of how serious you are. Yeah, and then I was able to enjoy it yeah. a lot more. Yeah. yeah. I think the best thing that this movie does is it raises the stakes. From all the previous movies, the action sequences are, are insane. If you've watched, you know, the trailer for the movie, there's this shot, all these parked cars driving in sequence out of a car park. And it's very, very well-timed and yes. it's a beautiful shot. And the entire movie doesn't stop, you know, the action is always going and you're always interested in what's happening and it just kind of, as the movie progresses, it gets higher and higher and higher and, and you kind of keep thinking, how can they top this? Which is mm -hmm. great because that's the whole series. This movie blows it out of the water. You know, you know but, I mean? But I still will say, t as a little caveat, mm. Bing caveat. Just remember that the stakes are raised and they're definitely more serious than they've ever been, mm -hmm. but it's still corny. So if you don't like corniness, the stakes are not raised in a way that you will enjoy. Everything else, it's been killing me. We we yeah. did the entire franchise yeah. leading into this yeah. and they have yet to say the word f oh, It just, I'm waiting for them to say it, because then, then I know that's the peak of the franchise. If you were challenge you, for if you can find in any of the eight Fast and Furious movies, if you can find that a character says the word f one time in any of the eight movies. And you gotta tag it with a clip. Yeah, we need we need proof of this. We will send you Cage's underwear in the mail. You I was gonna say send them a, a a pound of candy. 
We were already, no, we're already doing already that for something else. <gasps> Tie into our <laughs> giveaway. <laughs> we're like, there you go. Hundred subscribers. We're giving away a pound of candy. Yeah, we will. We'll we'll give you something. Um. They've confirmed there's going to be a Fast and Furious 9 and 10, mm -hmm. which the rumor is, is the final part of this final franchise. Final chapter. Yeah, it's like the final trilogy. Oh my. Listen, the important thing to remember is they're going to make these until they lose money. Mm. And they say that they'll end them at 10, but... They may still be going when The Rock is in an old folks home and it's like, time to bring back the f And he rolls in just like, <laughs> with his he oxygen tank. <laughs> I was so against it until that moment. Cause you know how Rogue One yeah. re brought brought in Tarkin. Mm -hmm. What if the Fast and Furious franchise gets to the point where they bring back Paul Walker completely? I don't think they yeah. would, but like, could you imagine they get to that point? Like, that would be under something dumb. Oh, what if they did? Follow me on this one. Yeah. What if they decide, just like Star Wars, yeah. they gotta go back. They gotta do the prequel to him becoming a police officer. It's, it's, a, it's a younger... It's a younger Paul Walker. Like a teenager, because oh, he was so already pretty young. Because then they could cast somebody else, yeah. and then do his story, and then the movie ends with like CG him. Yeah. I, I, we gotta go back, That's, that's how this franchise totally keeps going. Yeah, now. number 13. Because then they'll have a whole origin story for Brian, Buddy. and an origin story for Dom. I just realized, you oh, know no. what it is? You, tell you know me what more. it is? Tell me more. It's not a movie. Movie, TV series <laughs> picked up by Netflix oh I got it each episode alternates back and forth between Paul Walker and Vin Diesel but mm -hmm. here's the thing Ooh, the I kind of like that actually yeah yeah and it goes back and forth about their upcoming and it yeah. ends it culminates with them becoming the people they are that yeah. leads into the first movie yeah but here's the twist they do the classic thing where they almost meet a lot of times. Yes. And then every now and again, they do interact. But then you're like, wait, wouldn't they recognize each other? Yeah. They're like, no, because they were young. Don't worry about it. <laughs> it's the classic TV thing where yeah. they're like, no, you would have seen this. Yeah. Nah, yeah, you nah. yeah. I will not be surprised that ends up happening, though. I, I can hope totally there's see. a TV show. Yeah. yeah. I could totally see that. Yeah, you're welcome. I could work at a network and pump out terrible like I television to, I want that the, lots of people would watch. I want the title to be O'Connor, the first Furious. <laughs> I could see it being O'Connor. <laughs> yeah, I absolutely. I could see it being O'Connor, yeah, 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 yeah. But then if you want to do the back and it, forth. Yeah, then yeah. it can't be, yeah. The O'Connor Toretto story. <laughs> so, moving on? Uh, yeah, so... How could uh, you move on? This has been gold. So thanks for tuning in. <laughs> leave a comment below and your thoughts of the movie. Just leave a comment. I don't care. Uh, give us a like. Uh, subscribe. Share. You no, know, do, do all the YouTube things that you do on the YouTube. But do it for us. Yeah. You do it for everyone else and it's, it's our turn. Don't do it for yourself. Be fast and be safe.